Okay. The right. work on this. Oh, that was quite the. Uh, <laughs> I was audio. like, whose voice was that? <laughs> um, Whoa. <laughs> uh, so, yeah, we're going to start with Percy Jackson. So, Daiichi wa Percy. Um, Sugaku no sensei wo uh, keshite shimao, which is Percy. Um, I accidentally, well, accidentally it's not here. I completely um, evaporated my math teacher. And for wow. this line, we're going to give it to Cookie. Um, okay. Uh, ore datte, um, something. Um, okay. Nozonde. Nozonde. Um, Umarete. Ha, half ni. Uh, se, no, it's actually oh, oh. U in this context. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Umare tawake janai. Okay. Yeah. So I think it's like, um, what, what does um, ore date mean? I mean, it's like I something. Yes. Um, date is kind of being used as um, like even I. So he's saying, so in English, it went to like, it's not like, it, but it's it's not like. It's not like I hozondad. Um, so date is basically kind of being like, but I. Kind of. Oh, yeah. Ore datte. But, so you use it when you disagree with something, like you didn't want something. It's very common for the show. Oh, yep, I see. So ore datte, nozonde. Um, so nozonde means, uh, I've seen the kanji before. I can't remember what it is. It means it to means... wish for, basically. Yeah, to wish for, okay. Um, and then half, um, what, what is half mean in this? So half like is a word that they coined in the Japanese version to stand for half blood. So it's what? the, a half blood is going to be explained later on in the book, but basically a half blood is someone that's half God and half human. Okay. You know, so is that like, normal um, usage of half anyway? Uh, in Japanese? I don't know. Oh, interesting. I, mean, okay. I don't know. Many... I've never Googled okay. that. I'm I'm used to hearing that in the context of Japanese oh, Korean. Yes. Yes, that does show up that way. That's correct. I see. And then ni <clears throat> umareta wa that means uh, to be born, right? Yep. And then it's like umareta wa ke janai. So it's like um I'm not sure what the tawa means. Um uh the ta was umareta. That's a verb. Umarita. Okay, so to so be born. Instead, it's then... wake janai. So wake kind of means reason. And janai is like not. So yeah. he's saying, um, it's not like I um, wished to be born as a half blood. As a half blood. Saying. Yeah. So that um, makes sense. So next is, um, I'm going to do this one because it's a little awkward. Moshi kimi ga jibun wo hafuka mo tomote kono hon no yondeiru nara sugu ni kono hon o tonjiru koto. If, that's the moshi, right here, if you, um, kamo is perhaps, but if you perhaps are also a half blood, you think, um, then this book you are reading, you should, um, Sorry, that's been should um very fastly close it. So wow. stop reading it. Okay. And Okay, sorry, I gotta minus. Is it okay if I <laughs> zoom out once more? Um are you able to read like see everything, Daniel? Or is it or is it too small for you? Do you wanna go ahead and maximize the window by dragging it to the top? Um I mean, I, for me, the font size is fine because I have a, it maximized on my side and I have a large window. Nice. Um, <laughs> then uh, this I am going to need help with some uh, Fujiana, though. Exactly. Yeah. Um, <laughs> so <laughs> <laughs> I am here to help for that. Thank you. Because uh, once again, my, my kanji skills. Yeah. Gone. This is from the, <laughs> this is from the hardback version. And the hardback mm. version had semi Fujiana. So words like Kyofu I, has I it, but words like Yomu don't. Um, if you got mm -hmm. the paperback versions, just as, like if you decide you want to read it, it has old Furigana. Oh, interesting. So that's mm. just a different product. Mm. Okay. 
So is this is she there at the top there? Yep. So Stag gets cut off. <laughs> oh, so okay. I didn't realize that was a so. <laughs> um. Uh. So she. Uh. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. Oh, that's it's. Oh. Uh, yeah. Okay, so. <laughs> <laughs> Bad handwriting. Um, um, so, uh, Oya Kimiu Umare ni Tsuite ka Kataru. 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 Um, Uso o. Shinjite. Ah. Shinjite. Okay, I should, I should recognize she. Shinjite. Shin um, <laughs> Futsu no Seikatsu uh, Seikatsu o And then Naku Oku. Oku. Oku I have not read here nice. in a long time so this I know be... <laughs> well also my handwriting is very messy but I get to try again uh, I, have I think it would be time. better if it, you weren't writing over <laughs> <laughs> um, other text Pro oh, that's probably not <laughs> yeah that, that's a hard uh, thing to fix <laughs> mm. uh, so, so she, uh, Kimiu Kataru Uso Shinde 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 Futsu O Se Kau? Katsu Se Katsu Katsu Sekatsu Okuru Koto. Nice. So I'll help you split this up. First off, we have Soshite. What does that mean? Therefore. Yep. So, and um, this is Oya. So we have like a basically a, a different subject here. What's Oya, do you think? You might have seen uh, this kanji in <laughs> Roshi. Have you seen, do you know what Roshi means? Do not. So Roshi means parents, and Oya is kind of like a more like colloquial way to say parents, because this mm. this book is kind of um written like in first person, like um Percy's like your BFF and he's talking like straight at you, kind of like how it's like mm. wake janai and things like that. So we use Oya rather than Roshi. So your parents, they um they you sh you. Should Shinjiru? Do you know what Shinjiru means? Uh, I mean, is is it to do with death? She... Nope, that has a different kanji. So, oh, okay, she, okay. she 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 knew she mm. knew looks like this. So Shindeiru to be to be dying. Mm. Um, Shinjiru has the same kanji of you to say, and it's basically a person says, but it means like you believe what people say, like you have belief. So it's not like about like a concrete thing. It's mm -hmm. something you believe in. So something someone says is something you'd believe in because you don't have proof. Okay. So you should believe the uso, your parents Lies. kataru. Your parents yep. you. Yep. Or told you. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. Okay. Okay. Yep. So what were these lies about? Kimi no umoreta ni tsuita. Hmm. I'm going to assume something to do with the previous statement about being a half blood. Yes. Um, so first off, do you know what kimi means? Uh, you, but it's yeah. a more familiar term. Yes. And how about umareta? Mm, not sure. So umareta, um, cookie, you know this. What's umareta mean? Uh, umareta, that means to be born or to have yes. been born. So, yeah. mm. kimi no umareta me is the exact same thing as kimi ga. The first thing. Yeah. Um, as kimi ga That's umareta. Mm. As in, you were born. There's um, no difference when you put a no versus a ga because this is something called a relative like clause. It's it's basically it's helping you know that it's not the subject of the sent like the topic of the sentence. Um, mm -hmm. You know what nitsuite means? No. Nitsute means like about. Um, oh, I've so seen that before. All together it says. Okay, and... so the lies about your birth. Yeah. You should believe the lies about your birth that your parents told you. That your parents you. told you. And then he tells you something else to do, which is. 
So this right here basically means you should do this. That's what that koto is telling you. Mm. Do you want for two? Something about uh no, not for two. two means Does it normal. mean um normal? It's like a normal yep. life? Yeah, normal. Yep. A normal life. It's like you should try to lead a normal life instead. Exactly. Yep. To lead a normal life is seikatsu o okuru. This is a specific set phrase to mean that. Um, it's interesting because okuru can mean to send. So it's saying to send a life, a daily life. Oh, interesting. Okay. <laughs> but it me it means exactly what you said a second ago. Uh, in okay. English. Um, okay. Hakuwa na men ya oi. That one's so tiny. Cookie. Read that. Where are we starting? Okay. <laughs> Half of, uh, okay, I think that means dangerous or it something. It does mean dangerous. Kiken. Kiken. Kiken na meni ao. So, um, oh, is it mani ao? Is it meni ao? Uh, it's meni ao. Yeah, okay, good. Okay, so. Hafu, assuming they're talking about half bloods. Yep. Um they are they are dangerous and then the mm, men That's a good that's a good guess, but Kiken is describing the men yao. And ao kind of means to meet and me means yeah, eye. Yeah. So basically it's meaning that you catch dangerous things' eyes. So things that are dangerous will basically look, look at you. Yeah. So it's more dangerous for you to be a half blood. Yes. Exactly. Mm. You uh, okay. Um Kyofu no Denzoku Dashi Taite no Bai Kuyashi Yana Shinikata o Suru. Um you um feel fear continuously, like it's endless. And in most cases you the way you die is sucky and painful. Yeah. Ah. What I clicked. Hi, hi. I like that terminology, sucky and painful. <laughs> yeah. Um, okay, we're going to give this one to you, Danielle. You've seen this kanji earlier. Do you remember it? Where is it? Oh, it's Kimi. Yep. Oh, but then you circled me. What? Oh, no, I, I, was, I went to Kimi that's right next to E. So I did ah, this. Okay. And I was... okay. <laughs> Kimi ka futsu no koto kote kode kono hon o. What is the kanji after? Tsuku. Tsukuri. Um, I recognize this. Hanashi. <laughs> mm. ha, hanashi to ma. Omo. Oh, no, no. Omo. Uh, is that a little too? Uh, yes. Okay. Omo te, omo te, uh, yon, yon de iru nai, nara. Uh, and then, kekko, kekko. Okay. Right? Why don't you read it one more time? Hmm. Kinga futsu no kode, uh, kono hono, uh, kutsu, uh, no, tsuku. Yep, tsukuri. Uh, Oh, actually, this is even though it's banashi, it's pronounced as banashi in this context. Tsukuri banashi. Tsukuri banashi to omo te yonde yonde iru nara kekko. Nice. So this right here is referring to the line he said over here, which he was saying, mm -hmm. if you think it might be a half blood, sorry, it's this one, then you better close, close this book. However, kimi ga putsu no kode. Remember Futsu? You saw that earlier. Futsu no seikatsu o okuru koto. That's where it showed up. Futsu. We got mm. Futsu no ko versus Futsu no seikatsu. So, if you're a normal kid, normal yeah, child? Exactly. Because this book is um, middle grade. Ah, yes, yes, yes. Okay, I see why I'm not reading. I was expecting somewhere in that area. Yeah. Hi. Uh, so, if you are a normal child, then. Kono hon no tsukuri banashi to omote. Do you know what omo means? Um, omo, omote. 
I've heard omote, but I can't remember. What I'm pretty sure is. Cookie knows this. What's omote? It means to think. Yes. And hmm. tsukuri banashi means a made up story. So, kono ho no tsukuri banashi to omote means you're thinking this is a made up story. Wow, even in Japanese, it's they have kono. this made up story. <laughs> yep. So, omote yondeiru nara. This nara. Yep, if you're reading it, then it's kekko. What do you think that means? Oh my god, um, I've seen that so many times, but I don't remember. It's like, it's good? Basically, yeah. Kekko basically means like, it's okay. You're not saying, let's okay. do it, but it tends to be like, for example, it works very similar if you're like, oh, I'm good. I don't need that pie, for example. You can use kekko for that. Mm. Um but it's also like, oh, this is fine, anything like that. Um, so over here it's saying, if so he's saying, okay, you can read the book if you think it's made up and you're not a half blood, like it's fine. Okay, cool. Okay. Okay. So this is gonna be a little hard, but Cookie, see yep, if you can sure do thing. it. I'll have to run up to the top once you read the bottom half. Yeah. Okay. Mm. Don don, uh, and I think that means yonde. Yeah. Uh, don don yonde. Uh, or she. Yep. Okay, and then oh, that's the end of the sentence, right? No, that's the sentence. Yep. Don don yonde hoshi. So that's connecting from the kekko, which is that's fine. Don don yonde hoshi. Mm. So that don don means go ahead and read. Yeah. Don don mm. is kind of telling you the speed to read it at, like don don don. So he's he's kind of just saying like just yeah it's like fine it's like i want you to read this it's basically saying quickly read yeah. it don don mm -hmm. so um, kono ho no nakami ga uh dore mo tsukuri hanashi da uh to omoeru nande nante urayamashi nice so this this is normally pronounced as hanashi but this is actually a word so it's tsukuri banashi Oh, the goody banashi. We had that as earlier. And I forgot. Yep. <laughs> <laughs> to be fair, I did the same thing earlier. Yeah. So I guess that's a matter of learning. We have uh, both yeah. forgotten something read previously. <laughs> yeah. That Super aside, common. so it's like um, the inside of this book um, at the beginning, and then it's like um, Nakami. Na, so he's uh, talking about his opinion that he's Urayamashi. You know what that means? Oh, I have never seen that before. It means jealous. So he's saying, jelly. I'm jelly that um, the konohono nakami um, tsukuri banashi to omoeru. So he's talking about mm -hmm. omae. Omae ga tsukuri uh, banashi no omoeru no koto. He's, uh, uraya, he's jealous about that. So what does tsukuri banashi da to omoeru mean? Well, it's like if you think it's a made-up story, like loves. It means you're able to think it's a made-up story. So oh, you're able to think it's a made-up. So story. this okay. is the potential form of omote. So omote is to think. Omoiru is to have the ability to think. So he's saying so it's it... impossible for me to even think this because oh, I am a half blood. Right. This is my daily life. There's nothing I can do. So the fact that you can just be like, "Skuri banashi," he's jealous mm -hmm. of this. Wow. Um. The, and then the dorimo and nante are basically just kind of making that more obvious that he's very jealous about this. <laughs> um, and I think I'm going to give this one to you, Daniel. Okay, so... Ooh, what? That's <laughs> smart. <laughs> let's, see, let's, let's see how fast I can go. <laughs> okay, so... Kedo moshiko no hon o... Um, that ah, yes, I did it. <laughs> yonde, <laughs> uh, yonde te o, o, yeah. o, o oh, sorry, it's o, o mo. I don't know why I wrote, I wrote o for some reason. <laughs> it's it's uh, o mo. Uh, omoi yo, omoi yotaru to plus, uh, to... this is a, a little dot right there with the ah, that's my, my, my writing just didn't recognize. That's fine. <laughs> yeah, and, I, and I put that together. I, I did that though so bad. Uh, yeah. So, omoi ataru is what that says. Uh, 
Okay, so, I'm going to go to the place where I'm going. Nice. So, we're going to ignore the nada for now and、mm. the moshi. Because if these are deleted, you can just do the sentence as a sentence. この星を読んでいて思い当たるところがある。So, first off, この本を読んでいて。What does that mean?、Uh, you're, you're reading this book or somebody reading、yes. this book? So you're reading this book and then this happens. 思い当たるところがある。So, this is.、Um, Kind of, it's interesting because it's building from lots of gra- little small grammar points. Remember what a mole meant?、Uh, I don't know what that is. Yes. <laughs> what does a mole、no. mean? <laughs>、uh, to, to think? Yes, it does mean to think. So, specifically, a mole doesn't mean to like, think like the use your brain. For example, what's five plus five? Ten. Ten. That is not omo. That is kangaeru. Omo is basically literally saying, like, oh, I like popcorn, or oh,、to、I saw a cat. The, it's, it's, not, it's not. So omo is not active thinking, it,、mm. it's very passive thinking. So like, it's like belief. It's not really well, believing. Not less consideration. It, it,、uh, uh, so in English, we just have the word think. Mm-hmm. That's all we have in Japanese. Think can be translated as omo or kangairu,、mm. and、mm-hmm. they're very separated. And they took what we use this word for and put it into two categories. Wow, kangairu means you're using your brain actively, like five plus five equals ten. Pondering、mm. is also kangairu, like, man, why does the sun come up? How did my dog get over here? Why am I learning like Japanese? Is it useful in my future? That's all kangairu. So, omo is just not think, it's just the thoughts as they are without any like, there's no, there's no、um, cogwheels moving for omo.、Mm-hmm. It's just like, I like the color blue. That's omo. Muscle memory. <laughs> Almost.、Um, so, the omo yataru. Means that、um, something feels like familiar. It like strikes a chord with you. Because、um, omoide means like memories, for、mm-hmm. example. So、yes. omoyataru means that basically passively you're like, oh, I've seen this before. This has happened to me. I feel you, Percy. Sometimes I too think that strange monsters are. So if you resonate with、me. this. Yes, exactly. So omoyataru. Means so, omoita de tokoro basically means if you resonate, re- re- resonate with this. Resonate, there you go. Specifically, it says, does a place exist where resident, re- resonating、uh, occurs?、Mm. Hi. That's what it's saying when you're reading this.、Mm. So, the other parts though are,、um, however, if perchance this happens, then.、Um, He, and then he describes what that would be like,、um, which is Mio na.、Uh, oh, I didn't know you. <laughs> I, I'll read it for you.、Uh, I feel like it's weird words.、Uh, Mio na、hmm. Munasawagi ga suru nara, which is if your,、um, your uh, chest feels weird, like it's making a racket, like your heart's thumping, you're like, oh.、Hmm. Then what should、um, he do? Uh, Daniel. You want me to read this now? Yeah. <laughs> ah, Suguni.、Ah, uh, I do not remember the. the Gosh, we've seen that so many times. It, it was in the I line you learned earlier. <laughs> oh, I, I'm very much、home. aware.、Uh, it has, it's something you do with Suku, home. Suku. It's no. yo. Hono yomu. Oh, yo. Yomu. Read. Hi. Ah.、Uh, すぐに読むのをあやめること。So、that same、okay. koto being used as like an order. Do this. Oh, okay, okay, okay. So, what is やめる y a m e r u me. Yeah. Yep. Okay, okay. Or more like a stop. Stop. Ah,、uh, Of course, yes. That makes more sense. I had to think about it for a moment. 
That's why I asked for some things. <laughs> don't. Um, okay, so uh, Sukuni, Sukuni, uh, Yomumu, Yameru, Koto. Sukuni means immediate. So altogether, what so does if it that's say? So the case immediately stop? Yep, if that's the case, immediately stop. So altogether, it's however, if perchance um, you're reading this book um, and there exists uh, an area that resonates with you, with you. Um, or um, your chest starts to feel weird when reading this, quickly shut this book. Stop reading at all, right now. And the I next... don't think I can try giving any examples uh, for comedic effects because we're, this is going to YouTube and we don't want to get demonetized. <laughs> Oh, I'm sure mm. no no one watches it. No, no one's going to report. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, you say that, but I watched your that's Treehouse first read. Um, you know, uh, oh, yeah. it, we'll Next slide is going to be um, Cookie. Kimi mo half ka mo shirenai. Okay, so you are also. A half blood, and then it's like kamoshide nai. So kamoshide sure nai is a phrase that means like perhaps. Okay, perhaps um, that pretty much works. Um, so you are also a half blood, perhaps. Yep. So you might be a half blood, as well. Yeah. Shikamo, I really need to download your spreadsheets. And then, and then the sentence doesn't continue. <laughs> so that was Percy Jackson. Yeah. Um, probably the rest of these books will be probably too hard, but we can try mm. reading it anyway. We have another half an hour. <laughs> um, would you want to read Dialogue Ghost or Magic? Those are your choices. The other two are way too hard for you. I was never really a uh, big literature fan when I was <gasps> younger, oh, so no. I have no idea about any of these titles, even though I have <laughs> seen them before and I know so that. This one popular. is pretty popular. Uh, it's, it's the Satimius Heap series. It's the magic spelled wrong <laughs> book. Hmm. You see all the time in um, the bookshelves. They're just like, it's magic. Um, this one is not popular, Dialogue Ghost. It's a story about uh, an orphan that um gets like b adopted by a bad family that like wants him for money or something like that i don't remember totally it's been a long time since i've read it but basically the house is haunted but they're all like casper level ghosts so they're all like hi kid let's be friends and they basically help wow. him with the, the um bad situation with his evil adopted parents okay i, I remember cool. loving that story um magic is a story um, about a kid that is the seventh son of the seventh son, maybe. Uh, but he but he he's been like abandoned as a baby, and stuff happened. <laughs> I don't remember this. Um, I I was I loved Tyler so I still remember Timmy's heap. Like stuff happened in it. His name is Satimius. <laughs> but this one has magic in it. The other one doesn't. So mm, I see. Um, the other one is less fantasy. This one's fantasy. Same. Yeah. Um, uh, do, you one... have, do you know any like books that are um, like actually from Japan? Uh, I think yeah. these are all Western. These, these are novels. all they are all Western novels. Correct. That that's yeah. just because I like these. I like reading books that I know I'm gonna like. <laughs> I'm like, oh, I love these books. So I want to read. I mean, them. fair enough. Yeah. Um. Uh. Hmm. But I. I have read other like Japanese books, but um, it's just hard to pick out a book to read, yeah. to that, especially if you want it in like the right um level for you to be reading. Uh, I'm Pokemon Evolution. I read that, <laughs> and that's uh, fair enough. That's Japanese. This Tonai no Totoro. Is this where you find all these? Okay. Yeah, n natively is good for um finding books. That's not really how I found my books. That's just like I, I assume since you are scanning invisible copies. Yeah. Um. It, it, this is just a like it rates the level of the books. Um. It's still like pretty new, so the levels aren't like a hundred percent accurate. But you can kind of be like, oh, these books are like in the N three ish level, but it's it's based off of like what level like we put it in. So uh, mm. there's there's like user error and when there's not a lot of people doing stuff. 
But like Magic yeah. Treehouse, for example, it's probably pretty accurate because at least seven people have rated the book. So it gives it more accurate compared to like a book where just one person was like, yeah, I think it's about this level. But yeah, I recommend this site if you want to look for a book. That's like a run. I'm just like, how do I get to the search? Because <laughs> you can like just go to like N5 level. What do they think you can read? Textbooks. N3. What do you think I could read? Yotsuba. This is very good to know. Yeah, so maybe I should really get to scanning that book when I can. Yeah, that one I couldn't tell the level super well from it. That's the alien. You should see if it's Classroom on here. of aliens. I think I probably need the Japanese room name. Probably less known. I think it was published in 2002. Yeah, it doesn't have the one that you, that book you own does not have a, what's it called? Uh, yeah. uh, ebook version. I'm, I think, I remember like someone telling me saying, oh yeah, that book is, um, what, Classic. um, is a, is a very interesting book. Very fun to read. Mm -hmm. Yeah, it doesn't look like it's on natively yet. No one else has it's read okay. it. It's okay. Um, yeah. Okay, so do we want to continue for the next half an hour with the next page of a different book, or do we want to pause for today? What do you guys feel? You guys tired? I can I mean, go with another page. Um, up to you, Daniel. Okay. I'm fine. Whatever. I'm not anywhere near tired. I had plenty of coffee today. Nice. <laughs> Probably too much. Okay, so I want to stop sharing and just re-click the Zoom yet link because I'm on the free version of Zoom, and that's just how it goes. So mm. see you in yep. two seconds. So yeah.